If you're purchasing new appliances, you're probably reading online reviews, asking your friends for their advice and learning all the manufacturer specs. But you've probably seen a lot of buyer's remorse and comments from people wishing they had bought something different. Wouldn't it be great to learn all the nightmares to avoid up front so they don't happen to you? In this new series, that's exactly what we're gonna do. We'll show you the common and uncommon pitfalls and mistakes in every category, from starting a project to delivering without the several different types of damage that can happen to your home. With appliances breaking down more frequently, you would think buying an extended warranty is a smart way to hedge against future repair. But these warranties don't always work. In this short video, you'll learn the two biggest mistakes in buying one. Buying appliance extended warranties from appliance store seem like a good idea. That's where all your future problems start. The appliance store does not have a service department and 95% don't, they'll refer you to 100 number. That 100 number is just a call center who will beg local servicers to fix your appliance. Now let's pretend there are local servicers. If it's a big expensive repair like a direct drive motor and a front load washer, then that repair will not be done quickly, done well, if done at all. So if you want to buy a warranty, then buy it from any company with a service department, even if they don't sell the appliances. It's definitely worth your time to Google appliance service to figure out who is the best in your area. Before you buy extended service, look at the percentages of repair so you can make an informed decision. Refrigerators and stoves, especially pro ranges, need the most service. After that, the repair is not that bad for dishwasher, laundry, and hoods. We publish service stats and reliability. If you want to see the most reliable brands for this year, then click this link and thanks for watching.